Happy Wednesday friends. Today we have a quick and easy video. We're making a simple recipe. We're making oats roti or flatbread and with simple few ingredients which are here we have one cup of um, oats flour. Here we have one cup of water. We have one tablespoon of oil. I'm using canola oil and one teaspoon of salt so those are only ingredients and here we have a sufuria which we'll use in boiling our water i have a spatula here which i'll use to mix and later i'll need a rolling pin so i'm pouring my water i've poured it then i'm adding my salt i'm using himalayan salt um next I'm following this with my canola oil. This is totally optional. You don't have to use oil if you uh, you don't prefer. Cover and put to boil. And once this is boiled, put out the fire. And you want to use it when it's still hot. Because you want soft rotis. So completely add the oats flour oats flour oats and oats flour have a tendency to absorb all the moisture around them so this is what is going to happen here when you're mixing you'll realize that the moisture looks a lot and you will be tempted to add um some flour don't add just mix it like that and after mixing like this just shape it into a simple bowl and cover for 10 minutes so after 10 minutes it was a bit hard and i took some flour to help me in kneading so i just need a i needed a little and after kneading i went ahead to form a roll that will help me to divide it into small small balls that will help me uh form rotis so i divided it into half first then i divided it into fours so this brought out eight rotis um what you want to do you want to shape them into balls so i'm just placing them and i'll be shaping them into balls similar to that of uh chapatis um yeah so this is how it's looking and you just roll they are very very soft so it will call for a lot of flour my flour is homemade and so it was quite coarse um but if you get a very fine flour it will really help so as you can see it's so soft it's tearing but that's okay so this is how they came out they had a lot of flour but it's okay i just made a few but this is how you do all of them I'm using an aluminium uh, pan. My nonstick pan is currently in use with some food, so this is what I'm using. And I've not applied any oil, I'm just dry, dry heating them. Yeah, so hmm, I am turning to the other side, and it has not yet cooked well, so allow it to cook. So that you see it it bubbling or bursting and also changing in um the texture is signifying that it is cooking so i realized one side was taking like four minutes and another side was taking equally the same amount of time so for all your rotis give them time to cook give them four minutes on each side and I'm just flattening them. And yeah, this is how they came out. You can take this with some stew, some veggies. So remember when you're eating this, eat this to the glory of God. They're so soft and they're, they're so lovely and tasty. If you like this recipe, please give it a thumbs up. If you wish to see more recipes on my channel, just hit the subscription button 
and the notification bell so you get notified whenever we upload a new recipe have a blessed week bye